hey guys welcome back to the channel i know it's been a while since i vlogged but i was kind of going through some stuff mentally but i'm back now i just dropped you Layla off at her dad's house me and ezzy are about to go pick up his dad and his brother and we're gonna go check out this new place for like little kids your was too old to go um yeah, because you guys are the same age. <laughs> um, yeah, and then um, as he's supposed to spend a night with my mama tonight, give me some free time. Both the kids will be gone. I want to go to the mall if I have the time to take back these pants that I got from Torrent. So it's the video is gonna be bumpy, so I'm just gonna see you guys in the that, next clip. That, but one more thing, um, you guys might have noticed that the name changed on the channel um, from Jamie Nicole to Doll Baby Jamie because there's a lot of Jamie Nicoles on YouTube. So when you try to search my name, like a uh, different ones pop up, but there's no Doll Baby Jamies, and that's what my other social media names are like my instagram my tiktok it's all doll baby jamie so i decided to just have everything be the same name what look beetlejuice all these halloween decorations i haven't done anything with the kids for um fall and usually we go to like pumpkin patches and all that stuff but i haven't done that yet this year and like it's already the middle of the month we have to I have to plan an outing out with them at Mommy. like a pumpkin patch or something. Mommy. What, Ezzy? I saw a playground. You saw a playground? Yeah. The one yeah. Alright, I don't know how much I'm going to vlog while I'm with his dad because he doesn't really like to be in the vlogs or on camera or anything. So, um, I don't know. I might just get a little clip of where we're at. It's new. I haven't been there before. So hopefully it's worth it and it's fun for the kids. And as he's very talkative this morning, as you can see. Um, so hopefully it's a good time. Yeah, you did. He slept in my bed last night by himself. And he also got a haircut. I see your hair. He got a haircut like a week ago, I think. Maybe two weeks. I don't know. But yeah, he finally got his haircut again. I need to... Um, like do it regularly so that way oh we are the window down for all right i'll see you guys in the next clip there's a lot happening in this car and it's just the two of us i'm watching <laughs> this is a cute place I see you. There's a birthday party here. And there's a huge ball pit over there. It's pretty cool. Is it a spider? So we're done at the play place. I just dropped Ezri's dad and his brother off. We got the kids McDonald's. Well, we all got McDonald's. And that was a huge thing. Um, my dad is being super rude to me. And just negative as always. And just rude to everybody as always. Called me stupid. Told me he was going to me in the head, all this other bullshit, so, I'm done with like him. You're gonna punch him in the head? Like, I wish I could just record it, I wish I could have recorded that situation, just so he can hear himself, just, just to see he can hear how rude he is to me, and I don't do anything but help him when he needs help, and take him places, and I'm... He's just 
so rude to me and I, I can't do it no more. I just, I can't. Yeah, I asked Ezzy if I can have one of his chicken nuggets and he gave me one. And he was like, that one has a black on it. <laughs> he gave me the chicken nugget he didn't want. <laughs> but yeah, I'm just... You can tell my anxiety medication is working because... Back in the day before I got on medication, when he used to be like this and rude to me, like... I would get so worked up and so upset and like I don't even care right now <laughs> I just made the decision that I'm done it's not happening no more no more rides no more nothing like I said all I'm doing is picking Ezri up and dropping him off from now on because I'm not doing this no more like I try to do things with him for Ezri so that Ezri can do stuff like with his mom and dad but it's not worth it anymore. I think he needs medication, but you know, can't tell nobody nothing. They have to figure stuff out on their own. He needs to figure out that he's just rude to everybody for no reason. Even the people that are there for him and help him, he's still just nasty to everybody. Somebody has some, some, some stuff inside they need to work on work on themselves because it doesn't make any sense for people to be that mean. There's something going on in the inside, you know. But anywho, I'm about to drop Ezri off to my mom. And then I'm going to take these pants back to the mall. And just finish, you know, just enjoy my day. at me because when he was like being mean I just kept telling myself I was talking to myself I'm like this is temporary this is temporary this is temporary uh, Dad? and that's how I was getting through the whole situation by telling myself that I only have to deal with him for oh, another few Dad? minutes and then drop him off oh. so just reminding myself oh, that Dad, this is temporary Mommy? this is a temporary situation my yeah mean? very mean as always you yeah, punch him in the eye so yeah, I do that a lot. Like when I'm in a situation and I don't want to be in it, I just tell myself it's temporary, it's temporary. And that's kind of how I can get through it because I know that it's not going to last forever. And just like I knew I was about to drop his ass off, so I knew the moment was going to be temporary and I'm not going to let it ruin my day. So I dropped Ezri off. My eye is all weird and my makeup's running. I was just gonna go home, but I was like, no, I'm not going to the mall, but I decided that I'm gonna go ahead and go, but my eye hurts. My eye is really itchy right now. I gave my sister a ride home because she was at my mom's house and she has a dog. And apparently I'm allergic to her dog. <laughs> I swear, I feel like I'm allergic to every animal. Like, there isn't an animal I met that I'm just not allergic to yet. Um, hey, Layla really wants a dog. I want one. We have a dog at work, though, um, a chihuahua. And I'm fine being around the chihuahua at work. But, like, if I hold it, then, like, my skin gets itchy. Sometimes I'll hold it. But then I gotta, like, go in the bathroom and, like, wash my skin and stuff off but like her dog bothered my eyes like made my eyes really itchy I didn't hold it though it was just in the car with me and my one eye like immediately started getting bothered it's so weird it was the same thing with the guinea pigs I was sneezing a lot with the guinea pigs and when I would clean their cage when we had guinea pigs like I felt like I couldn't breathe I was allergic to them too I know I'm allergic to cats for sure. Like, I'm allergic to cats really bad. But I've noticed that it's like some dogs that... No, I guess it's all dogs because every dog that I've come in encounter with, I've showed some sort of allergic reaction in some kind of a way. 
It's weird. Yulela really, really, really wants a dog. I would get one if I wasn't allergic to one and if I was home more. I feel like I work too much and we're, we're away from the house too much for us to have a dog. Like I work 10 hour days. I'm away from the house 11, 12 hours some days and that's just, I can't do that to a dog, you know, to a pet, so. <sighs> but I'm gonna go to Torrit even though I just want to go home. Like, I don't know. I got a headache. Arguing with Esri's dad and, like, I don't know. I just have a headache. But I'm going to go to tour to take these pants back. I'm probably not going to try anything on because I really just want to go home. <laughs> and I might grab some food for later. I did eat a bowl of soup at my mom's. She made some chicken noodle soup. But I just want to grab something in case I'm hungry later. I have zero groceries at home. Like, none. I need to go grocery shopping. I have no groceries. Alright, so I'm here. I made it to the mall. My eyes feeling a little bit better. I was, like, driving with the windows down. Like, air blowing on my face. But I just feel like my... Yeah, it looks a little better. My makeup's a mess though. It's all right. I'm not impressing nobody. Don't know why I give a crap about me. <laughs> all right. Let me go in. Oh my God, you guys. I was in the mall for a really long time. I actually, um, I went to Torrid. I took the pants back. And then I ended up finding two lounge sets um so i got those they're technically pajamas but um they're like soft and comfy and that's what i was looking for soft and comfy and then i found these two shoes they're like these like slide ons i got the tan ones and i got the black ones or these are like brown right and they're just slide-ons the black ones aren't furry inside but the tan ones are i just wanted some shoes to just slide into um i don't know how comfortable they're going to be but hopefully they are somewhat comfortable <coughs> and then that was all i got from Torrit. Two sweaters, two like sweatpants, jogging pants. But like I said, they're like the lounge sleepy ones. And I got them in a 4X. I usually buy 3X clothes, but I have gained I've gained a little weight because I used to be like 270. Last I checked, I was 283. Um and I just want it big. <laughs> I just want it big and comfy. Um so I went with the four. Ain't no shame. And then I stopped to Claire's just to see if I could find anything for you, Layla, for Christmas. And I did find her a few things. I don't want to, like, show you guys or say what it is. But um, I did end up spending, like, $50 at Claire's. And um, then I just got myself some Chinese food. I'm going to go home and eat it. But, yeah, I didn't vlog in the mall at all. But I'm ready to go now. Yulela is hard to shop for this year. Just because she doesn't really like toys. She kind of, it's like she just, she's not really into it anymore. So like, it's really hard to shop for her. Because she's not like super girly yet. But like she likes some girl stuff. But she's still kind of tomboyish. Um, and then she doesn't play with toys. She just kind of plays with her phone and her tablet. And... Um, she's hard to shop for. I didn't think it would be this way for a 10 year old. I thought I had at least another year or two, but <laughs> apparently these little 10 year olds are teenagers now. <laughs> um, yeah. 
I don't know. She did make me a list. She made me a list and there was um, a few things on her that was totally crazy, but I don't know. <laughs> All right, I'm going home. I'm back home, you guys. I just want to show you what I got at Torrid real quick because I'm not going to do a Torrid haul, but like I said in the car, I got these. You can see them a little bit better now. Some slides. And then I got the black ones as well. Hopefully they are comfortable. If not, I can at least wear them at work because um, with winter coming, I want to have some sort of like slippers or like something on my feet at work. So maybe I can just use them for that if they're, if they're uncomfortable to wear all day. <coughs> and then their bags are new. Look at the bags. Their jeans. Well, jean print. So these are the two loungy outfits I have. I have a gray one like this that I wear. So I saw this green. I thought it would be cute, especially with like Christmas coming up. But this is it. It's so like, just like plain and like nothing fancy, but like I got it oversized. So that way it can be like super big and comfy. Um, Cause the other one I got was a three X and I mean it fits, but it's not like as comfy as these are. And then green, let me turn this light on. Sorry. I want to turn a light on, but yeah. So super soft. And then I got the black one. Like this was, like I said, this was in a pajama section. So <laughs> it definitely looks like pajamas, but I don't care. I'm wearing it. It has like the moon and then the stars on the bottom of the pants. And then the shirt has like a rocket ship or something but I like it. It's starting to be that time of year where you want like sweaters and like cozy things on. So it has that on it. And that's all I got. I had a whole list of things that I wanted to do today, but I ended up being out all day which is fine. Um, then I got myself some food. Dang, it's 8.20. I'm about to eat this food. It looks good, don't it? Get myself some insulin. I'm so thirsty. I haven't drank hardly anything all day today. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna charge my phone, put something on TV, eat my food, throw some laundry in the washer and this house is a mess and it's just gonna stay that way tomorrow after to work tomorrow eight to three and then i have a baby shower my niece's baby shower that i'm going to after work so even when i come home tomorrow i'm not gonna have time to do any cleaning <laughs> which sucks because we're having inspection for our apartments i live in public housing and they're doing inspections um in a week yeah, I think in a week, so I have to get this house together. <sighs> but it's fine. I have time. I have time. I just want to sit down and relax. Tomorrow's going to be a long day. Yeah, it's going to be a long one. <laughs>